Hello? Testing? Okay, that works. Sweet. Good morning, Arthur. Feels like we're back on track, more or less. Yep, money and food. Now everyone needs to keep it coming. For sure. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Okay, Arthur. Sit down, Arthur. What do you think of this place, Susan? An improvement on the last, that's for sure. Well, that ain't too hard. Hey! Oh. <clears throat> Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a... Strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Do you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out. Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses already. <sighs> Uncle's so fucking lazy, man. You're gonna take the old man into town. You can take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a ride, and you're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on in. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment of civilization. A shithole, but it's a great shithole. We love Valentine. Uncle's just hating for no reason. Alright, All right, let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do in Valentine. We're about to get our natural Red Dead Redemption radio. This is the radio that they need for GTA 6. They don't need no actual radio, they just need like people singing in the car, like carpool. Right. Let's help this boy out. Lumpy. Oh hey, I sure can. Alright, let's go get this boy. Come here, mister. You've gone astray. Easy. Whoa. I'm down there. Right. Lead. Take him. Sweet. Easy enough. Can I run with you? Okay, no, I have to walk with you. I have to walk with you. I size this fucking thing. God damn. It's not quite a uh, Bill's horse, but it's it's still a unit. I guess all horses are, to be fair. Wouldn't want to mess with any horse. And kicked right in the fucking face by one. Okay. Here is your precious white horse back. Here you go. You're a gentleman, sir. A gentleman. I'll take that for the honor that I lost last stream, because I remember I still lost it for shooting that guy in that mission, in the prologue. Alright, Valentine. Excuse me. 
What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart. A small one, perhaps, hidden deep inside, but a real one. And you haven't, your pulse of old lizard. Well, blizzards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. To be honest, if you lot hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> well, you did. <laughs> we could have robbed him. The camp needs funds anyway. Just a question if he actually has anything on him. Or is that uncle? <laughs> oh, very funny. This looks like a decent little town. Yeah, I love Valentine. Valentine, I'll die on the hill that Valentine's my favorite location in this game. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Go live here, right. down the main street. Sheriff's office on the right. Sure, you can pick up some. Sheriff's office, drugstore, the saloon, the best bar of this entire place. Yeah, that's a young man's game. Ooh, yes, we can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? All right, let's go. Let's park up down the end there, near the stable. Excuse me, Mister. Oh fuck, I'm gonna run into you, aren't I? No, okay. He was moving over to me though. He was looking to get hit. Here we are, just like I said, That's BM. Cultural center of civilization. Right, where am I heading to? Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're gonna do what any self respecting maniac does. The saloon. Put the women to work. Oh wow. Pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Okay, so we're going to the general... Oh, fucking hell. Right, we're going to the general store. I imagine Paris and Valentine... So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. Uncle's go. Oh, shit, Arthur's still speaking. My bad. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm. Then, rats with the plague. Look at Uncle, man. Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. Right. Morning. Uncle's evolution from this game so, to the first one is think? something special. Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. Something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? You're looking a bit tired there, Arthur. Why don't you pick up some coffee while we're here? Coffee. Well, on the shelves, but I got more out back. All right. Uh, Here's the door. Let's get coffee. Crackers, ground coffee. Okay. Done, how much do we have? Fifty-five dollars. Um, I'm not. I can't remember how much I actually have on me. It wouldn't hurt to pick up a couple of things though. Some biscuits, bread roll, they're cheap. I got a couple of bread rolls. Fuck it. Arthur loves a bread roll. So you're actually uh, tobacco, you premium cigarettes. Right. We'll pick up cigarettes for the dead eye. I kinda neglected oh. I neglected Dead Eye a lot in my last playthrough. Uh I've already got coffee, it's fine. Sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. Now I know what the smell is. Well, that's a ripe cheese, all right. Predator bait. Okay. I'll pick up an apple. A carrot and apple. We should be good. Some stuff for the horse. Well, look at this. All right. We're fine. What is this list of yours? We're fine. Yo, Cameron, it's good, bro. Here's to your good health, my sir. What's well, good, bro? <sighs> it's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Uncle's like a messed up Santa Claus. I mean, at least he looks like it. Gentlemen, I think I got we didn't get there. drunk off whiskey, did we? All good. Uh, it's been a... Like a servant girl. Usually works. Not even 24 hours. It's just been an interesting day. I woke up feeling like shit. I've just been... I felt really, really bad this morning. 
Like, I don't know why, if I were really bad. And then I took a big ass nap in my living room, and then I woke up and I felt quite better. So I think I napped the depression off, but. Like, I've experienced depressive episodes, like, a lot, but that one caught me off guard. It just kind of hit me like a fucking bullet, and I was like, oh, okay, I'm not okay anymore. So I've been very unproductive today, I'm not gonna lie. I've done, like, nothing, but... I was sat there... I was just sat there, and I was like, well... I can sit here and feel, like, tired, and... I'd watched enough YouTube where I was like, right, I've kind of done watching YouTube for most of the day. Uh, and I was like, I could stream, because that's at least doing something productive towards something I want to do long term in the future, or I can continue to sit there and feel shit. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to go to bed earlier tonight, because I really need to get sleep, especially if I'm going to go to work and then have to do training tomorrow, so... I'm just gonna do that. I'm gonna I'm gonna get like an hour and a half maybe on this and then probably just go to bed or some shit. I'll still need to eat as well, but Thanks, Arthur. I'm just trying to keep myself occupied as much as possible to be honest. Look after her. I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. It's funny how you can seem to try and do all the things right for yourself and then I'm looking for a um, came in here earlier with a drunk feather. You still feel kind of shit at times. It's amazing. I feel like I've been doing a lot of productive things this year, like trying to help my shit, like self out with my situations. But I've have still got a long way to go. I think. Same productive. Yeah, it's on your story that you're doing some some college work, which is good to see. I I don't even know about my idea. I think I might go ghost mode and come back with like a new fucking idea um because i'm not getting anything done and we have only 10 weeks left minus the two weeks over the holidays i might just like disappear in the holidays and come back with the fucking completed thing and if i have to redo like the powerpoint then i fucking will You sure? Yeah. And Sarah's video June, April holidays, so stressed. I'm just, you know what? I'm gonna take my camera. Stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. I am the reflection kinda good. Um small town bank. Gonna take my camera. There's lots of cash sometimes. Go outside. Okay. Stay inside. Film something. I hope uh make it eight minutes. And that's gonna be it. Because I've got a lot on my mind, and it's honestly kind of good to throw whatever's on your mind. Especially as a creative student. I'm just gonna throw everything that's on my mind down on a fucking video. And see if it turns out either shite or turns out good. Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. G2. I'll get I'll get G U two done no bother. Yeah, my motivation for a lot of college shit's kinda dying out now. I don't like this. Hoping university is gonna be a bit better. Get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. I do hope it'll be better. It's just been I don't know. Like, when we had that talk from the lady who's, like, worked, uh, like, on Britain's Got Talent and stuff and stuff, she said she preferred university to college. She found college harder than university, but that's just kind of, like, the way her brain, like, operates. Because, obviously, university is more, uh, up to the individual to get their stuff done. Like, there's no, like, assessment deadlines. It's, like... Have this done- well, there is, but it's like, have all of this done by this date, and then you can, like, schedule it yourself. Which isn't the best for me. Why are you telling lies about me? Isn't the best for me, because I'm not really good at scheduling stuff, and I will put stuff off to the last minute, because I'm a really bad procrastinator. But, at the same time, it's also going to be, like, less stress on me, so... And if it's something I'm actually passionate about, then I'll want to do it. So I'm hoping university is going to be better. 
Okay, I come here. Help him. But yeah, so head's in a weird place right now, but I'm hoping. I think my plan for after the, the college is done, obviously we're gonna have time um, between then and university starting up. I'm gonna want to pick up more hours at work, but at the same time, that's like a time frame, that's a window of opportunity to push it as much as I can with this channel and try and see how much I can grow and get done because I've got to take my opportunities when I can and I know what I want to do long term so it's just making it happen I want to make money so that's why I want to take more hours at work but at the same time like because I know I'm not making money from this right now I'm quite a while off making any kind of money off of this, to be honest, but... I don't know. My problem is my brain won't shut off and shut up ever. So, like, I, I be thinking so much into the future that I don't focus enough in the present. And it's like, I'm thinking long term about working, where I want to be, what I want to be doing, where I don't want to be suffering. Like, I don't like my job. I like my job, but like long term, like do I, is this where I want? Is this what I want to be doing for the next sixty odd years? You know what I mean? But then there's like all all over thing is like, will I even get be able to afford being an adult? Like, will I ever be able to afford like having a house and shit? There's all the shit I write down in my journal at the end of each day. I'm like, will I be able to afford this? Will I be able to do that? I'm so fucking stressed, I don't know why. Absolutely stressed out of my mind. Oh no, do not quit the game. Yeah. Yeah, I do want to focus on the channel. I've done a lot of streams recently. I uh, haven't made a lot of videos. Um, just my motivation for like all the editing stuff's kind of died down, but a, l a bit recently. Oh, this is your horse. I'm sorry, sir. I'll give you your horse back. There you go. That gets me respect. Um, but recently I've been watching a lot of videos that have kind of been getting a lot of attention. It's all just been like people playing Minecraft. But there's like, it's like minimal editing. There's like barely any editing at all. No big flashy effects, no big sound effects. This and that, because I like that kind of stuff. But at the same time, sometimes I'm like, damn, I kind of just want to film some gameplay and just talk for like 10 minutes. But like, nobody's going to want to see that. But then I started seeing people doing it. It's like, people actually want to see this, which is kind of crazy. This is the best mission. This is one of the best missions in the game, by the way. Oh, we're all going to be, oh, 100% we're all going to be homeless. I should stream the Papa's games, actually. Exactly. Yes. They need to bring all of them out on Steam. Whatever you say. Need to bring them all out on Steam, man. Cost, anyway? well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. I fucking love Excuse Roger me. Clark, man. I'm gonna meet Roger Clark one day. I'm gonna be happy. You got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charm. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh man, I dread to think about it. There he goes. Bill's so aggro for what? I mean, he's drunk, to be fair. Fucking hell, Charles. Alright. Come here, sir. Throw one. Bitch, 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 bitch. Wait, that guy's face down, ass up. Wait, the guy behind him in the red that Bill knocked out is face down, ass up. Ow, oh, fuck. Did you just knock my hat off? Sir. Fucked. Who's next? Welcome to Valentine, you bastard. Excuse me. Get him Javier. Get fucked. Get fucked. Nice. The position, man, is crazy. Oh shit! Just break a chair over my back. Sir, who do you think you are? He's got the mutton chops and everything, excuse me. Fucking hell, how many gut shots can you take? 
Oh my god. Right. Here we go. Half of you, you're getting the shit kicked out of you, son. You don't understand, though. I un I downloaded this, uh... I downloaded this app that, like, you can easily download and play, like, Minecraft mod packs and shit on. It's, like, Modrant. Uh, so I've been playing this, like, Dwellers mod thing, which has, like, been pretty fun. But there's this, like, other, like, Minecraft horror mod pack that looks a lot of fun. So I've... I don't know, and then earlier today, like a lot of today as well, I was playing like Minecraft beta version like 1.7.3 and just fucking chilling. That's all I've been doing. I've literally done nothing of worth today. At least like just helping myself chill out. Ow, fuck you. Ah, fucking hell. Excuse me. Break free, break free. Oh my god, what the hell is he trying to do? He's trying to have sex with me, bro. Get off. In the crotch. Come here, bitch. Oh my god. Get fucked. Wait, I'm gonna kill him. Damn! Surely that's enough. Covered in mud. <laughs> I love meow. Arthur Morgan is a big meow. I love Arthur Morgan. He's who I aspire to be. Oh. I can't wait for this week to be over, though. I want Saturday and Sunday so I can just do nothing. Well, I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. Charles, the only one on the I fucking love that. As can be. Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him. Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty. Dutch kind of fucks though in this I fit. I have to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater, uh, ah. Well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Fuck you, Bill. <laughs> well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill. Come on. Now we gotta go get a bath. Fuck the water, bro. We go get a bath. That's the hotel. Where's the bath place? Is this the bath place? No, that's the bank. Where the fuck is it? No, oh, no, it's in the hotel. I'm tripping. It's in the hotel. Right? Welcome back. Hello. Yeah, a bath. 25 cents, my god. I got someone warming it up for you already. We go through here. We take a little journey through here. Is this TOS? This might be TOS. We might get taken down. Oh shit, we're seeing too much already. We're seeing too much. Scrub head. They just be having alcohol out like that? I mean, I mean, I mean for 50 cents, yeah. Chat, this is fucked up. Chat, chat, we can't be doing this, bro. Chat, oh my god, fucking hell. You'll leave this place feeling brand new, you know. They just kind of have alcohol out, though, it's kind of crazy. 
<laughs> like some no small talk. Arthur's feeling antisocial while getting That's scrubbed in the tub. It says chat. It Bottom right. It's crazy. Right leg. Yeah, it's not too bad. Okay, we're done here. I've seen enough. I think I think I think YouTube YouTube partnerships have seen enough. If I want a future on this platform, I think we have to stop that. We can never do that ever again. But we're clean. That's all that matters. I still don't have my hat though, I'm devastated. Fuck is crying. Thank you. Right. Uh, that's my honor level. That's not looking too hot right now. Right. Where's my horse? My horse is far away. I don't have a good. Re oh, my bad, sir. You okay? Oh, I've made some ops. I did not mean to do that. Excuse me. I'm gonna run away now. I'm trying to keep my honor. There is someone over here looking for someone. Oh my god, hello? Who else wants some? Huh? Sure, I'll shoot you. I wouldn't mind some practice. Well, let's get to it then. Oh shit. Go to the dueling position. Oh fuck, I haven't done this in a long time. I was never good at this. Am I shooting him or am I shooting it out of his hand? Do I get in trouble? I was never good at this, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you. Right. I shot his hand. You're still alive, right? Wait, I kind of slayed that, though. Fuck. Get fucked. But you killed bro though. Look at him. Now, back off. You actually just straight up murdered his ass. Did that leave a mark in your hand? How detailed actually is this game? Okay, I don't think it did, but... I don't think I've ever done that before. Poor guy. Oh. Right. Uh, what can we do next? Whose mission? Well, there's a stranger mission here, actually. Let me go take a look at that real quick. We ain't only trying to do just the main missions in this. We're trying to... I mean, this is... I know it's my second playthrough, but... There's still... I haven't played the game in a long time, so there's still a lot to be reliving. Is this the one about the book? This is the novel one, isn't it? Or whatever. We have to go and fight all the... Not fight them, but find all the outlaws. Excuse me. There we go. It's not bunk, Mr. Who's your friend there? Ha! Put that in your fucking book, Fredo. This is Jim Boy Calloway. Jim Boy Calloway. Me, Jim Boy Calloway. Who? The gunslinger. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 men in a fight at Lucy Hollow. What are you waiting for? How do you mean? Well, I reckon right now, kill him yourself. I don't want to kill him. I want to deify him. He's a god. I'm trying to write his biography. How's that going? Damn, damn, damn. I think damn, I prefer damn. the duel. Either I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Damn. You're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win. Freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm going to write that down, if I may. Be my guest. <laughs> What's your name? I don't have a name. But you are a gunslinger. Not really. I mean, folks who need shooting, I try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff, it's, well, bunk. But you fought duels. Once upon a time. Well, I just did. I man. just literally did. Are you interested in fame? Jesse McCray Overwatch? So yeah, man. Strange. But you like fortune. I need money. Oh, he's just so like I don't know how to describe him. I seem a little desperate. I fell in love with this character so quickly. He's just so fucking like badass. There's a whole list of gunfighters. But he's so like cool, calm, collected about it. Don't even know if he's like aware how actually like cool he is. Flacco Hernandez. Billy Midnight. 
He just carries himself with such aura, bro. Maybe you can go and speak to them. Ask them about Calloway. Any of them get up at he. I don't want the twink energy. I want the Arthur Morgan energy. Shoot him. I can't believe I just said that, but you want me to go and find some sad, deluded fools like him. Ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get up at he, shoot him. Does sound a lot worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. Half the proceeds of the book. If you help me get it written. Damn. Fifty percent. Oh, get photos. Okay. And there are the no X seventy ass karma, bro. That's the kind of shit you book from the hatch. I imagine we'll be stuck here upon your return. Give me your student ID and we'll give you that. Some other flop house. Right. Why did I lose fifty cent? I lost fifty cents for the fucking beer. Oh man, fuck. Right. Uh, well, I think the first one's kind of far away. Right. Oh, wait, I have to look at them all. Shit, wait, um... Then I'm looking at my satchel. Because you have to flip it. And then, yeah, yeah. So we have to do that for all of them. Put it away. Billy Midnight. Flaco Hernandez. Doom. Then one more. Who's it? Emmett Granger. Flip that shit. Put it away. Right. So if we go to the map, I'm pretty sure they tend to be kind of far away. Oh, okay, well, if we go down here, as uh, Flaco, sort of Flaco's all the way up in the. Yeah, yeah. So we'll do that later. We can do Emmett Granger once we do, like, Reverend's mission. But for now, I'm not too fussed. I'm kind of going to do whatever. I think... I don't want to do a Strauss mission, because Strauss pisses me off. Uh, I'll do a Kieran, and then we'll go Hosea. But I need to go get my horse. My horse is kind of far away. <gasps> Dog! Hello. Let me pet you. Arthur does have a heart of gold, right? We need to get our honor up as well, so we need to go and. Excuse me. Got a smile on my face today. Hi there. Anyway, we need to be nice to people. You any longer. Okay there. Hey partner. Hey there, Mister. Hello. You remind me of a feller I used to know. Uh huh. Sorry, can't put my finger on it. Goodbye. Hey there. Here we go. You literally get high honor in this game just for being like a social butterfly. The man of Riz, Arthur Morgan. Some fine ass pants you got on here, sir. I'm feeling good today. Nice. Sorry, you don't need to know this. Howdy. You better watch your behavior around here. Damn. Just passing through, don't want no problem. Gentlemen. Here we go. Right. We'll do that the entire time, like on the on the playthrough. There'll be a, a, a ton of um, getting the honor up because currently we're sitting just below halfway, and we are looking for the high honor ending as always. I mean, I could lose some honor by hijacking. Uh, oh, this is the murder mystery thing, right? That's kind of vile. Damn. Poor guy. Fucking hell. Do I interact with this shit again or do I not? I can't remember. Well. Oh, wait. There's a white dot. Oh. Uh, that is pretty vile. You poor bastard. This is, a, I remember this being a fun little side thing though, the murder mystery thing, or whatever. Poor bastard. Piece of paper shoved in his severed head while the rest of his torso is. Where's his legs? Where's the poo's legs? Right, we're getting Arthur some cardio in because the horse is too far away and I didn't decide to rob a, rob a horse off someone. Next horse to show up on the path, I'll just hogtie the person and run away with the horse, I think. 
Oh, Arthur. Arthur's a bit like me in the cardio department. And of course, because I don't have that high bond with my horse yet, I can't, like, cross-map the fucker. Unfortunately. But in due time, my friends. Can I, like... Please, Pearson would be so proud, and I don't want to shoot you. Come here! Oh my god, yes. Skin. Damn! Oh, my horse! Hey, buddy. I was not doing anything. I was just, just getting some turkey feathers. I was just getting some turkey feathers. Alright, let's go. Bill, shut up, Bill. Okay. Right. Let's do Kieran's mission. We'll do Jose's mission. And we'll see what's happening. Are we able to get some bear stew? Is there some stew kicking about in the camp? Is there a fresh pot of stew on... No, Jose, I'm not doing your mission yet. Calm yourself down. I can't remember that. Oh, it's over here. It's over here. It's over here. It's over here. Let's have some dinner first before we speak to Kieran. Grimshaw, can you? You're not Grimshaw. You're Mary Beth. I will be polite to you then. You're not Grimshaw. Bring Pearson animals to supply the camp. You can use the meat and the food and the skins to cast satchels with. Well, that's great. You need good in town. How are you doing, Mary Beth? Thank you. It was fun. Can you hurry the fuck up? Oh, okay, right. First of all, you know what? Fine. Well, we Dutch. Right, while we wait for Pierce, uh, Mayor Beth to be done, is Pearson gonna... Can I donate the turkey I just found? Oh, we're gonna get to fishing as well. Uh, where's the... F oh, plump bird meat. Right, there you go. I've done my part for the next 72 hours of gameplay. Donate you some feathers. Look at all that blood on you, you boys. It's getting bad. What can you this? Miss Grimshaw? Starting to look like home. Right, how's the boy do? Marston! Love you. Oh, Marston, I no longer love you. Why the fuck would you send me off like that? Right, what do you want? When's this going to end? Speak. Don't cry, boy. Speak. About your gang. <laughs> I can. What do you mean you can't, bro? Tied up to a tree. You're in our ownership now. You pretty much have to. Oh, hold your horses there. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? I told you, mister. I told all of you. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Horseshit. You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah, uh, who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Okay, yeah. damn. Oh, yeah! What's he doing? Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. Oh, brother. Unix was among the happiest and most loyal of courtiers. Oh, you kidding me, right? Of course. You sick bastards! Oh, what do you want from me? Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. Bro. Okay. Okay. I was gonna say, at this point, you have to say something. And you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at six point cabin. Uh, I'll take you there. Serious. I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you. No offense. Oh, none taken. Okay then, partner. Uh, Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? Pull your protectors up, boy. Should be fun. All right, you. Come on. Let's go. Okay. That was a very. That was an experience and a half. Can I get my hat back though? It's really I I. Don't like Arthur without his hat on or something about it. Are you sure as shit was? John, Bill, come here. We got 
a social call needs making. Right, six point wherever. Uh, John, you take this little rattlesnake. Lead then? Talk about some I'm gonna lead and then does nothing. Right, there you go. Sharing saddle with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? How many times I gotta say? I ain't an old Driscoll. You sure look like one and you smell like God damn. You smell like one too. I smell like horse shit. That's right. Boy, are you high. Okay. Morgan, you got throwing knives in your saddlebag. Dud said that you might. You want to give me something? How about you give it to me? Real. Instead of hiding it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes up to mention it. Last goddamn favor I do you. Hey. I'm so ops for no reason. Hey. You're almost as bad as Micah, man. Fucking friends. hell. It's over here. Yeah. All right. I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. Okay. How you holding up, John? Fine. Still ain't right, but I'm fine. You damn well should be after all that bed rest. Hey, all right. Abigail would Yeah, bro, was, bro was like in bed for like you know her, months. You won't be reasoned with. Well, when you was having a failure of reason, hiding behind your woman, we were getting shot at. And I'd do the same for you. You was in a bad way. Foreshadowing. <clears throat> uh, so, but I fear you don't know how to help anyone. Except in yourself. You see, old Driscoll? If this is how he treats his friends, imagine what he does to his enemies. I got an inkling of what you all do to your enemies when you put those gelding tongs to my parts. Well, you still got those tongs? I got a knife. Won't be so clean, but it'll do the job. Keep that in your mind, young feller. Right at the forefront of it. I swear, I promise, I am taking you to comb as best as I can. You'll see, I'll make good. I'm fucking better after that statement, boy. My god. Right. We need to get to this. This is okay. This is the only thing. It's not like a gripe about the game, because it's like. Bill just killed the fuck out of that. Um, it's like the traveling parts are like calm and peaceful. But I guess for like stream purposes or like content purposes, if you've not really got much to talk about at that particular moment in time, it's like, damn, the ride, the ride all the way there happens a lot in this game. Like, there's a lot of like, let's talk, let there be a break of silence while we ride there, and then five minutes later, you actually get to do the mission. But if you're just playing the game like chill, it's kind of like, unless you're like, you don't really want to be bothered with that part, you just kind of want to get to it, then it also could be a little bit of a problem, but we take this game for what it is, because game is one of the best games ever made. It's crazy how, like, the, the dialogue makes me realize how much of, like, an influence, like, Dutch has and the way Dutch is able to gaslight situations and, and push narratives and stuff amongst the group. Now, who knows if this son of a bitch we got with us is talking true, but if it's what he says it is, and Colm O'Driscoll's here, we can end years of fighting. Here and now. Amen to that. Here, here. Okay, we can all agree on that. This is where he was. Shut up. Okay, now, now cut left up here. We, we go down the hill into the forest. Going in quiet. Taking them out as we find them. Trying not to set things off. But if we do, we move quick and hard. Settle this like we know how, okay? Let's fucking go, Arthur. You tell him, boy. With you, Morgan. All right, then. Through the trees here. Hey, we're real close. 
I'd leave your horses the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off my horse, and I'm ready. Easy, Bill. Fine. Rose weapons. Uh, what do we need for this fight? Uh, we don't need the bow. Um, I'll take this, this. They're still in okay condition. Don't need anything else. No, I think we're good. Yeah. We'll be good. This is it. The cabin's just the other side of this hill. Okay. Off your horses. Let's go. Okay. You wanna get them knives? I said easy. Oh yeah, fuck we need the knives as well. Um throwing knives and the repeater. Okay. Oh, I need to the bow for some reason. That's fine. Follow me, all right? It ain't far. We might have shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you. Every moment. I ain't gonna shop you now. Come on. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. But you'll lose your balls first. Jesus Christ. Hey. There, there. You see? Okay, get down. Just telling the truth, always a good thing. Cabins in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there too. Are these fellas armed? Armed? Drunk? Wary of strangers, yep. And Colm O'Driscoll? Oh, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. Hey, over there. Someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. The feller that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell him yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm -hmm, yes, yeah, sir. Come on. Well, take he's on. taking his final piss. Right. I'm assuming we're gonna kill the guy peeing. What are doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by the tree. I'm taking we'll the lead in this one. First Okay, go to work. Okay, we're gonna be stealthy, because last stream we weren't stealthy when I apparently was supposed to be stealthy, so we're gonna do this the right way with a knife. Oh my god, okay. Excuse me, I just need you for a second. Hey boys! Oh. Um, let's do it the quieter way. Never mind. We don't do things quiet on this channel. Excuse me. Right. Eh, uh, okay. Kill you. You in the back. I want to kill you. Shot you first. Got you. Eh, uh, right. Okay, it appears we have set things off in the Wild West pretty heavily. Uh, you're injured, you're headshotted, you just missed you. I should probably take cover actually, that would be the smart thing. Um, got him. He's down, he's injured. Uh, shoot you, no. So that's, almost a, that's an explosive. Okay. Uh, damn! Wait, let me cook. Wait, let me cook. Or maybe not, actually. Maybe not. Oh, let me cook. Let the aim assist cook. Excuse me. Ah, I got you. Come here! Get fucked. Oh, that's so gruesome. I love that. Boom. Don't love the switch of camera. Oh. 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 Oh, okay, maybe I need this instead. It's better off. Uh, come here, boy. Damn, does the revolver do any damage? Fuck me. Okay. Can I loot people first? I would like to loot people first. John, are you stealing my loot, bro? I would like to, before I search the cabin, and before I get any grief from my uh, my posse for not searching the cabin instantly, 
We need to make our ammo back. We need to make our money back. They are. John's just stealing my goddamn loot. That's crazy. This shit's for me. I'm playing the most of this. This horse stimulant. Okay. Right. Now I'll go comb. I should reload before things kick off, though. Because I cannot remember this mission well. Okay. Oh. That's what you get for being too... not hasty enough. No, I didn't. You did. Come on, Driscoll ain't here. He was here, I swear. I swear. I mean, if I was sending you up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. It is, man. He is kind of cooking with that. All right, then, go on. We'll just let him die. I won't kill you. I didn't set you up. You're lost. Shit, lost. I'm letting you run away. Now, go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. Out there, without you, Como Driscoll's going to lose his mind about this. <laughs> so? So I'm one of you now. Wait, let him cook, bro. Give me a break. All right, then. But I'm warning you. Oh, I, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash, then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash. In the chimney. I'll check it. Rest of you boys, get to camp, quick. See, Arthur? Yeah, I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing. Not yet. yet. Well, we're in the same mindset. We're in the same mindset. Right, the chimney. Uh, oh wait, there's funny too. Actually, I always do these house raids in first person just because my eyesight is not great. Money. A dollar. Single dollar. Oh no, we have some money clips here. Ten dollars, that's much better. I mean, a dollar's a dollar. We'll take a dollar, but... Ideally, we're looking for a little bit more. A little bit more for the camp funds. Take shotgun shells. Okay. Lockbox. Nice. I was hoping there was going to be a big water cache in there, but that's fine. Uh, okay. There's the table and everything. Before I check the chimney, can I check this? I can. There's nothing in it. There is shotgun shells. Perfect. Right. Now the chimney. Money. There we go. At least you got something tucked away. Six hundred dollars. Wait, the shotgun. We can take the shotgun. Ooh, nice. Right. Double barreled shotgun. It actually has been so long since I played this game. Maintain it. Oh shit, yeah. Clean it. Yeah, it actually has been so long since I played this game, I forgot which weapons we get at which point. I know if we do favors as well, like in Valentine and stuff, like the gun stores, the guys can give us like a free thing on their, uh... A free weapon, and they put it on their tab or whatever. Okay. Right. And then we can rob this guy, because no one, uh, no one looted him. What have you got on you? Ah, silver pocket watch. We'll take it. Right, I think I was going to do... What did I say? You've picked a, a valuable. You can use valuables in crafting, sell them. In... Okay, yeah, I already knew that. We'll probably... Do... I said I was going to do um, Jose's mission next. There is, however, a bounty hunting, a bounty, uh, hunting mission. I'm going to do the bounty hunting mission. Then we'll go over to Hosea. And we'll see how we're doing for time. We'll see how we're doing for time. 
How's my levels looking? <coughs> Pardon me. Bless me. Sorry, even. Um, we could do with some energy. It's better. Oh, I did not mean to do that. I was trying to interact with the guy, but I went too fast there and ended up just galloping. Just the scenery of this game. Look at this game, it's beautiful. Hello. Hello. Sure is some hard country around these parts. Well, yep. Just the game, man. Look how beautiful this game is. All the cinematic stuff I see on YouTube that people are like editing together and stuff, it's still to this day, it's just like a gorgeous thing to look at. Right. Bounty hunting missions don't tend to be too difficult at all and they pay well, so that's exactly what I think we will do. Hit you up and let's get going. This is our man. You a bounty hunter, mister? Maybe. It depends. But I'm guessing you ain't here to pass the day, turn yourself in, or discuss the finer points of county law. Then I don't need to know much more than that. Till I got a reason to. All right. You smell that? This here's a livestock town, mister. Tracks delinquents and reprobates like flies. Now, I'm not a fellow to pass a quick judgment, but I've been around long enough to know you don't hire a saint to catch a sinner. Real. You bring me what I need, and I'll pay you well. Nice mustache. No questions. Okay. So, what is it you need? Why don't you have a look at that poster on the wall over there? He's a low-down huckster. He's been poisoning folks with his miracle cure from here to Ansburg. Killed more than landing rickets without even pulling a trigger. Gets some kind of sick satisfaction out of it. So he's poisoning Miller people. over at the saloon says he thought he saw him by the gorge straight north of here. You think you can bring him in? The money's good. Is this the one where he falls in the river and we have to follow him? I'm getting the feeling it is. compensated before he swings. I'll see what I can do. Either way, we're bringing him in. We're bringing him in. He will no longer poison the people. That's an important point. Yeah, we need him alive. Got him. Hog tie him, put him on the horse, take him back, no problem. Okay, let's go get ourselves a bounty and make ourselves some money for the camp. Horse bonding increased to level 3, perfect. Unlock skids. Hell yeah. And also the horse health, and I can just overall call him from a quicker, uh, sorry, a further distance. Investigate the gorge. I don't know why I just took that long way. I could have just skipped that bit, to be honest. I don't know why I did that. Anyway, not the fastest horse in the West. I will need to get myself a quicker one or have this guy level up to the max at some point. But you know what? We love this horse. I haven't even named the horse yet. Okay, let's. Hey, I swear he's up here. Yeah, he's chilling up here. Hello, mister. You Benedict Albright? Oh, sir? Huh. Kind of look like him. And I was told he'd be up.